Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Larry Vision. Um, I'm here with um, Amy and Tony, and we're going to be riding River's Edge today. Um, it's a little, little further down from the shed, probably about 20 to 30 minutes. Great riding, fun progression. Um, it's becoming more and more technologically advanced as well. As you can see here, as a trail condition indicator and it is good to go there's the trail in case you have never been there you get to see the trail map and hoping to just have a great time today since this is the first time i've actually done any video uh, here i am gonna do the way there the way back and give a full uh full kind of review of River's Edge for people that have not been here because it is a fun, fun place. It's very windy, flowy, a lot of good stuff. Now this is just the uh, the trail to get to the trailhead um, from the parking lot here and even it's kind of fun it's very windy and flowy and it's got a rock tiny little rock feature that you can jump and you know stuff like that it's cool Woo. And now we climb. So the climb is the same each time that you do it. So I'm only going to record the climb one time. And this is uh, the climb from midway point. And it basically just step backs up. All that uh, excessive climbing I did yesterday is starting to already feel. All right, so this is the trailhead where all the trails kind of break off. <sighs> so, oh no, you need to go back. <sighs> so here again, this trail map. There's where we started and I think we're here now. So this is something that's new. Um, it's got a, a air pump and tools and a bike stand here at the trailhead so you can actually fix your bike if you have problems. That's just one of the coolest features I've ever seen on a trail. So this is uh, the skills course okay. here. Amy doing the teeter-totter. There's a little skinny there. And then here is a couple drops to teach drops, which is very cool. And got a little speed bump or pump bump and a bridge to kind of get people used to different things that they have to learn how to ride out on the trails. It's very, very cool. We're gonna go do crap i messed up sorry um we're gonna go do bees hive one time so that he can see the jump 
Um, I messed up, so we had to go back. And here we go. Gonna hit the jump again. So I'm gonna do it a little slower. I said slower, that felt way faster to me. Um, this is right after the uh, bees high jump. Um, after bees hive, you can come down here and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the bottom, uh, probably take goonies to the bottom and uh, then we're gonna do the XC trail over there and uh, come back and start the downhills. To the right, to the right. Flowy, very flowy and fun. All these trails over here are just fun to ride. Not near, not near the what the shed is, of course. You know, no, no rocks, and it's kind of nice to get away from that every once in a while. So this is a uh, Goonies, and it'll bring us to the very bottom where the XC starts. Okay. Just so much fun. And that was the end of Goonies. Now we go down the hill a little. A little jump. And we're hitting the XC section. This is going to be a long video. So I will try to cut out some of uh, the climbs and you'll just have to come experience them for yourself. So I'm up towards the top of the XC at this point. So I figure I'll record the top and down and then uh, start the downhills.
What the heck did I hit? Oh, right <sighs> 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 GoPro. <sighs> I think I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, I fell into uh, all those trees just for fun. Yeah, they're just they're right there. I, uh, Pedal, I uh, did a pedal strike. You can tell right there, pedal strike flip. Yay! All right, we're just gonna keep it on camera. That just proves as you get tired, you do mess up. And after 16 miles in the shed in one day, the next day you're tired. I don't care what you say. Sure, you can ride more, but you're tired. <sighs> Woo. front of my bike's off <sighs> I need to fix it <sighs> that's about as good as it's gonna get oh yeah it's better huh <sighs> kind of made the uh, uh, made the fork bend or uh, twist just a little bit with the handlebars on that last one. Whew. Gonna get my footing good. trailhead and uh, I talked to Tony and we decided we're gonna go um, the easiest to the hardest um, to get the progression and to show uh, show everybody that's watching so uh, here we go the first one's all the way down and I think it's called one trick pony there's not much to it once you get there but again it's fun to see it all I like that they have little jumps and stuff all over. So if you are more advanced and this uh, just normal riding around on the trail would be boring. The little jumps and all the cool stuff that they've thrown in make it where it's not. And there's one trick pony. Um, this is, I believe, the easiest. Is this the new one? No, this is the this is one of the first ones they built. This is uh, the green. Oh, okay. <sighs> all right, we're gonna take it.
and that's one trick pony gonna start into the blue the blue is called uh you've got to be skidding me That was fun. This is too fast for love. And I was going too fast to start recording correctly. So I apologize. do Carlos Inferno now um, this one as long as I can remember and not hit my brakes going into this berm I should be fine step up easy though Tony has been killing it. What do you think so far? It's a great place. I'll definitely be back. All right. Well, we're going to go down this last trail. Um, I don't know the name. It's not posted. It's new. It looks pretty, pretty windy and bermy. So we're going to take it and see what's up. <sighs> Carlos Inferno again. Oh yeah. That's fun. Oh, that one is so much fun, guys. I had to do it again and get it on video. Hope you enjoyed. And that is River's Edge.